tuning in. Today, I've got an error message on my R1250 on the screen, which says, tire pressure does not match set point, please check tire pressure. It's the, it's the yellow sign, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, the tires are okay, so it must be some sort of gremlin in the system. Uh, so what I'm going to try and do now is to clear it using my um, my professional level GS911. Now I've got the GS911 connected here to the CAN bus socket uh, behind the right hand uh, cover of the bike and I've connected it all to my laptop here. So to enable me to show you uh, a little bit more detail I'm going to have to flip the camera around uh, and hold the camera in my hand so let me apologize for the quality it's not going to be the best but hopefully it'll allow you to see a little bit closer uh, of what I'm trying to do and actually might help any of you guys I don't know so uh, uh, so bear with me and let's see how we get on Here we've got the the error message uh, as you can clearly see I've turned the bike off and on a number of times and I've also checked the tire pressures and they're fine as in the previous video I've got the uh, 911 connected and it's connected up to my laptop. So let's see. I've already ran an auto scan and it's picking up the fault uh, tire pressure sensor front, front. The fault is not present now. So what I'm going to try and do for this initial uh, stab at it is to clear the fault codes like so. It's just thinking about it. Just thinking about it. Still just thinking about it. All fault codes cleared. So I'm going to OK that. I'm now going to uh, turn off the ignition. You'll see that the screen's gone now. So that's the ignition turned off. And... And the ignition back on and you can hear the uh, uh, the butterfly valve groaning there isn't it wonderful uh, and there we go it's actually cleared the fault uh, which is good and if I do a another auto scan hopefully everything will be okay Down there, scroll down. And yes, everything seems to be tickety boo now. So that's how you can resolve an issue on your R1250 GS uh, if it's just a gremlin. Um, if it's not, of course, uh, it could be. It could require further investigation. It could be a, a duff tire pressure sensor. I don't know. Hope that helps. If anybody wants to come along and uh, have a free scan or, or just pop in for a cup of coffee, uh, because this this professional level um, uh, GS911 allows me to do as many bikes as I want, then you're always always welcome. So thanks for watching. Ride safe and bye for now.